We wanted to do another little update because it's been a while again since we last posted and thankfully this time it is not due to being sick or having illnesses and you may be able to notice that my face is working normal again and I can talk normal again which is really nice and has been a major blessing for us. Um, I feel a lot better as well too so um, it took about four weeks from my face looking like this to my face looking like this. So, other things we've been up to that have kept us from posting is we've decided that we are going to try to move. So, we had been looking for the last probably like six months to a year for a place with a slightly bigger property where we could keep all our animals and where we would have enough room for our current house size, which currently we have eight kids right now and so we need a big house. Um... So we've been looking kind of off and on. We've been looking at other states and just hadn't quite found what we felt was the right place. Then just recently, a couple weeks ago, we found a place that fits our family size, that it's not quite the amount of acreage that we would have liked, but it's enough that we can have our goats and our chickens and even add a little bit more, hopefully, to our homestead and still have room for a garden. And so we have made an offer, they accepted it, and now we are in a mad rush to get our house looking as beautiful as we can and find a buyer. We just listed our house on the market. We've gotten a couple projects done inside the house. I'll show you some pictures. We remodeled all three of our bathrooms. <music> updated our kitchen with a new backsplash. We also painted the cabinets in our kitchen and put new handles on which made it look so much better than it did. We also, this one doesn't have to do with the house, but we gave a cheap horse trailer that we found. We gave it a facelift and got it repaired and to where we can drive it and use it. So we'll be using that, you know, for our goats to move them to the new house. We also have been just kind of working on fixing up the house, painting different rooms and getting as much done as we can. Um, we also have some exciting news with our goats, which I will take you there tonight with me when I go to feed them. So our news with our goats is that Miss Stella is pregnant. This one is Stella. And that she is due any day. She's getting nice and big. Her ligaments are already starting to thin. She's starting to bag up. So we actually just tonight separated. That's our dairy goat. She's a Nubian. We separated her from Stella. And you don't always have to separate them. But Minnie, our Nubian, is very aggressive. And we are concerned that she might attack Stella's babies. Um, she just as very aggressive towards Stella and last year was very aggressive towards Stella's babies and we don't want to have her have her babies and us not be here and then have Minnie attack them. So we went ahead and separated them. We put some new straw down so that it's nice and clean and warm. Sorry it's kind of dark in here. Hard to see but we'll be doing some updates as we go as we're getting ready for babies and do an update when she has them. So that's kind of the last bit of our news. Thanks for checking out our channel, keeping tabs with us. When, and thank you for those who actually watch our videos. Um, if you are new to our channel, welcome. And please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel so that you know what else is going to be going on. 
and I hope everyone had a great holidays. We had a wonderful holiday, spent it at home as a family, and I look forward to giving baby updates. See you later.